terribly helpful, really. Full of regret, mostly. Nuka Cola right away. Depending on you hear that? I think I just heard a bloat fly or a red roach. Okay, let's see what experiment Vault 81 consisted of, shall we? I don't remember if this vault was mentioned in Fallout uh, 3 at uh, Vault Tech HQ. Vault door remote access ready. Ooh. Hold it right there. Vault 81 security. I don't know where you got your hands on a working pit boy, but you better start talking. I got it in Vault 111. Vault 111? Haven't heard of that one yet. And what sort of business are you looking to take care of here in 81? Uh... Just looking to do a little trading. Is that so? And you expect me to believe that... Oh. Overseer. Who is it, Edwards? Ma'am. Some new Commonwealth traveler. Not one of our usual traders. Well, if someone wants in, they can earn it like everyone else. Really? Let me speak to them. Sorry about that. Officer Edwards here was just doing his job. I'm sure you can understand our need for caution. Yeah. For newcomers, we like to operate on exchange. You help us, we help you. Really? Depends. I need more details. Fair enough. Let's go. Fusion cores. Three, to be exact. You get the fusion cores. We grant the access. Done. I happen to have exactly what you need. Really? Well then, by all means. Welcome. I'll be down to meet you at the entrance. Hmm. Okay. Overseer McNamara. You need a doctor, need Forsyth and Rachel. Everyone's down the best. working hard right now, Cal. You. you think I don't know that? Just do the best with what you can. Nice full tech That's security uniform. Fine. I'll see what I can do. But you and I both know we can't keep going on like this. Sorry about that. As you'll soon see, we have a few maintenance projects underway. Gwen McNamara, Overseer. Welcome to Vault 81. Here, we pride ourselves on having maintained a successful vault over these past two centuries. We'd like to be completely self-sufficient. But there are certain resources we can't provide ourselves. Why do you keep yourselves so isolated? Why not? We have warm beds, clean clothes, a solid roof over our heads. Our food and water are radiation free. We don't deal with the elements or raiders. We're safe here. And for some, that safety and stability is what counts. You should be wary. The Commonwealth is a dangerous place. Exactly why we rely on a select few traders for our needs. That's why I like to use a give and take system. If outsiders are willing to help us, we're willing to help them. Speaking of, if you're ready, I can take those fusion cores from you. Here you go. I'm sure you'll put them to good use. I won't, but Dr. Penske certainly will. Now, I have work to do. Ma'am, what about the dog? I'll allow it. Security is already extra mindful as it is. If she's lived this long in the Commonwealth, I'm sure she's chosen her friends wisely. If you need anything else, I'll be in my office. That text conversation was all kinds of bugged up. Excuse me. So, we got a new visitor today. Don't say anything, but man, I'd love to be out there. If you want to leave, why don't you just go? Wish it was that easy. It's scary leaving the vault. And the Commonwealth? It's all so unpredictable. It takes some preparation. I'd learn how to use a gun and be ready to use it before I went out there. I've never even touched a gun. Now, I can't even say if our security has seen any real combat, but with the hours we're working these days, 
I'm not even sure where I'd find the time to practice. Why the long hours? Why the long hours? We're just making sure this roof over our heads doesn't cave in on us. They say it's all the moving parts that have us working around the clock these days. Structurally, I guess 81 is still pretty sound. Vault Tech sure knew what they were doing when they set these places up. Well, I don't want to keep you, and I gotta get back to work. Maybe I'll see you around. You know, one day somebody might actually You're adjust to do some these. Training, and make them look better. for the depot. Alexis has just about anything you could need. Hi. Another outsider. What they let you in for? You're a jerk. What's with the attitude? I don't trust outsiders. We didn't need your help before. We don't need it now. The overseer never should have opened up the vault to your kind. I'm a fellow vault dweller. I don't care where you're from. It's not here. Watch yourself. Huh. Terminal somewhere. Hmm. No signs of radiation. Impressive. But I am irradiated. Okay. Hey, Ashes, what are you doing up here? Ashes, where are you going? Ash. Uh oh. Damn it. Karen's not going to like this. Where'd the dog run, or cat run Dr. off Penske to? Dr. Penske runs a hydroponics lab here. She may have some work for you if you're interested. Noted. Hydroponics may need... I got two words on what I expect out of you. Best behavior. Right. Okay. <clears throat> now that you made it in, we'll be keeping an eye on you. So do us all a favor and behave yourself. I normally don't kill people that don't give me a good reason. Normally. Poor Erin. Her cat got loose in the Commonwealth. Ah, oh, so many things that provide me with things. Going, I assume, down. Looks like down. Yeah. Oh, it actually says dog meat now. When did that happen? Hey, lady, are you really from the Commonwealth? Me? No, I'm from the moon. Still got cheese on my shoes. I guess that was a dumb question. But I bet it's your first time here. I can show you around the vault if you want. Just five caps. That's not necessary. I can find my own way around. Oh, you're no fun. And I hate kids. What's your point? Go away. I'm heading out. Don't wait up for me. Again? But I need your help here. Seeds. I'll need more seeds. Hey there. So, you're the new gal. I heard we let someone into the vault. Uh, how long do you plan on sticking around? Not sure. Not sure. We'll see. Yeah, I guess we will. We can take care of ourselves here in 81. We don't need to be letting in every stray traveler that comes our way. Vault boy. That's why I got let in. Excuse me. Oh, you're that new traveler. You must have had so many adventures out in the Commonwealth. Is it boring here in the vault? No, I love teaching these kids. But it's not the same as fighting to survive. Would you mind talking to my class about life in the Commonwealth? I suppose I could tell them a few. I won't let them take up too much of your time. Stop nagging at me, Alexis. Okay. <clears throat> Our Commonwealth guest, welcome to the depot. And pardon the clutter, I don't get much time to tidy up these days. Hmm. I didn't even notice. Thanks for being polite. Let me know if there's something I can get for you. I've got a little bit of everything lying around here. When you're dealing with items that are all over 200 years old, work just accumulates like crazy. Some days it's all I can do to keep my head above water. But you probably don't want to hear about all that. Let me know if you want to take a look. I might be interested in buying or selling. Great. I have all sorts of odds and ends. Wow. Do you have ammo? Why do you have so much ammo? Where the oh, I guess the fiberglass is tracking it. Okay. Fair enough. Uh. Hmm. You have surprisingly little of anything I could really need. Except for this. 
I'll take that. And that. Hmm. And that. Let's see, is there anything I don't need that I have on me? I don't want to sell that. It's technically a unique item. And I haven't looked at the helmeted cage armor yet, but I don't have one, so I'll probably keep it. You, uh, you need some... some of these things, right? Yeah? Baby? Can I have some of my extra drugs? Because I hardly ever use them myself. I can't wait to see how excited the kids will be. She's Watch looking me. pretty bad in there. Sorry, new gal. Not a lot of time to talk right now. Not even just for a moment? A moment? Well, I suppose. Not like I actually want to get back to work. <laughs> what do you do here? Me? I'm just the lucky sucker in charge of maintenance here. Sorry if you heard me bickering with the overseer earlier. She and I don't always see eye to eye. So there's a lot of upkeep going on right now? Hell, you could say that again. Old lady one here, she's a straight up wreck. Pretty solid for a while, easy enough to keep up with her needs, but in the last few years or so, damn, she got feisty. Been going through tools like they were going out of style, so if you got any, I'd be more than happy to take them off your hands. How much are you paying? I'd say 15 caps per tool. Overseer won't let me go higher, but I'll take as many as you can grab. Okay, fine. Sure. You got yourself a deal. Stupendous. One less thing to bug the overseer about. Anyway, here I am running my mouth when there's work to do. Sorry I can't talk longer, stranger. But mind the maintenance. Shouldn't get in your way, at least. Okay. So, overseer's office, Dr. that Forsyth way. Dr. Forsyth is asking to see you when you have a moment. Oh, what I wouldn't give for some real time off. Doctor's looking to see me. Well, this is not the doctor's office. Not at all. Uh, oh, it's a lower level. Need to check the water pumps again. The water smells funny. You should stop by the lab in the morning and take a look at the new crops. New crops, huh? is doing quite well. Excuse Very me, Doctor Pinsky. Strong cellular plant structure. I'll have to tell Gwen I'll be needing fertilizer. Barber. I'll have to see how Thanks, cool Horatio. I love really? it. I didn't think I'd ever make it in okay. with the hours I've cool. been working. She did, and now you look completely refreshed. Mm, you whipping up a new batch of pies today? I heard Alexis promise one to Erin, and I know how you hate to disappoint the little ones. Marcus William Somerset. Oh, don't you go on thinking you're so clever. Those pies are going to be for Calvin and his crew. Lord knows they could use a treat right now. Hey, you tried telling that to Erin and breaking a little girl's heart. I didn't realize my wife was so cold-blooded. Mark, I swear, over 40 years of marriage, you need to count your blessings you're still alive. Another new face in the vault, eh? What is it we're needing now, Missy? Come again? What do you mean? Well, Gwenny... Oops. I mean the Overseer never lets anyone in unless we need something. I figured someone put in a request with her if we got a new face in the vault. Lord knows we could use some help around. I gave some fusion cores to the Overseer. Fusion cores? <laughs> Must be for something high-tech. I was hoping for a crate of mute fruit myself. The people here, they're a bit overworked these days. Some blame the Overseer. But it ain't Gwenny's fault. Poor girl. Just landed the right position at the wrong time. It's not easy being a leader. True words were never spoke. I wouldn't want her job in a million years. Well, I best be getting back to it. Don't want the old lady on me again. Sixty-two years old and still fiery as ever. So you must be that new traveler Gwen led here. It's always nice to see a new face around here. Who's Gwen? Oh, Gwen's the overseer. But I could never get used to calling her that. I've known that girl since she was in diapers. If you need any food for the road, or just feeling hungry, you let me know. Our menu isn't quite as exotic as the Commonwealth, 
But it'll do in a pinch. Trust me, the exoticness of the Commonwealth is not, uh... Not today. That's all right, honey. If you're hungry later, stop by. Not really anything I want to have to say. Lavatory. Ah, I see. Okay. We'll dig in and hold this position. Residential? Huh. So you're the reason the patrols are double today. No. No, the patrols were already uppity as it was. Yes. But you should know that. Actor feed. Huh. Okay. I refuse to believe there's something specific going on here. Huh. Hmm. Or sorry, more of something in specific. Katie Pinn is the teacher here in 81. You should stop by her class. She's big on learning. Clinic. This is the doctor that wanted welcome, to see me. There's two welcome. people in here. You wanted to see me? I hope I'm not being presumptuous, but I'd like to ask you a favor. Would you mind donating some medical samples, even just a blood sample? Am I for some caps? You want to dicker about money? People's lives are at stake here. Either do it because it's the right thing to do, or I'll wait for the next Commonwealth visitor. Just have a seat, and I'll draw some blood. A seat, what, here? No? Doesn't count? Here? Sit there. This will only take a sec. Fine. But, That's uh... Hardly heard a bit, eh? You should know that Thank I come from you. a vault. This will be a great help. Now, I need to get these prepared immediately. Hello, Dr. Forsyth. As the doctor of Vault 81, I expect a certain amount of respect. Uh-huh. You're that wanderer from the Commonwealth. I'm Rachel. I assist Dr. Forsyth with his medical duties. Are you sick or injured? Not interested. All right. Excuse me. Okay. So I'm assuming this is medical storage. Hmm. Bolt tech, 10 count. Doesn't say what's in it. Weird. Okay. Okay. Must be rough living out there. Eh, a little bit. Oh, now you're down here. Why are you in here now all of a sudden? That's just random. The work never ends in Random Hulk resident. Hmm. Hmm. All these rooms are so much different. Storage. Okay, noted. Watch yourself. Mm. Huh? You should stop by and see Horatio while you're here. Can't imagine you come across many barbers in the Commonwealth. Uh, I know of one. Okay. If you think you may be able to lend a hand, talk to Calvin. He may have a job for you. It's I'll hard not to take my work home with isn't gonna but need I promise you. Overseer's office. I'm just gonna walk on through. You know, if you don't mind. Hmm. Overseer's personal bathroom. Take time to look around. You'll have the full run of the place. Overseer, feel free to make the most of the services we offer while you're here. Hacking this is beyond me. Hmm.
Shut off radio. Hmm. I'm gonna be honest. I really want to know what experiment happened in here. But I can't do it unless I can access that terminal. And I haven't seen an overseer's password sitting anywhere. Am I really going to need to get some uh, hacker perk in order to break into here so that way I can see what happened? Because that's disappointing. I really need to stop pulling my gun out in blazes like this. What I wouldn't give for some brand spanking new genuine vault tech parts right now. Hybridization. It's got to be a flaw in the hybridization. Hmm. How did I get information about this vault? Where was I provided the information to come to this vault? Huh. I don't remember now. Pretty sure it was in Vault City. Not Vault City. Wrong game. Uh, Diamond City. Boy I'm in a vault. Up on you? Mine's no. been glitchy lately. Oh, wrong way. Uh, I don't know. Mine is a glitch. Sorry about the maintenance. It never ends these days. Doctor Forsyth and Rachel have plenty of medical supplies to get you stocked up. Ah, uh, nope. I'm on my way out. I'll probably come back at some point, but I'm leaving now. The sheer fact that aside from entering into the cave area where Vault 81 is, like the entire vault isn't instanced, that's a big improvement from the previous games. Okay, so... Move marker. And now to continue heading uh, southeast. Hmm. It was supposed to have died from that. <laughs> really? Just die already. That poison's strong. Where are you going? Okay. Dead it. Very good. Okay, so what's going on here? Dead Brahmin. Obviously by these. Automatic laser pistol. Glowing red roach. Trap. Why is there a trap, I wonder? Move! Psycho, Mentats... <laughs> Medics. Lime clock. Hmm. Oh, hello. Hey, rude. There we go. Yes. Buff out duct tape. Grenades, right away, stim pack. Yeah, basically just take everything. Hmm. Random. Really random. What? Uh... Why is... Why is my game frozen? Well, crap. 
I guess I'll take a small break then, since my game decided to randomly freeze. So I'm going to call this good, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.